Nope. Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin for those of you that are new here and if you're not, welcome back. Thank you so much for being here. Today's video is going to be short and sweet. I'm going to be sharing with you a wellness shot, not a shock like grandma just thought I said, not an alcoholic shot, but a wellness, I kind of look sunburnt right now with this lighting in the kitchen. I'm making this because I'm starting to feel like I'm getting sick, a little bit of backstory in my mouth, the back of my mouth, not my throat, but like back line of my mouth just starts to feel weird. And that's how I know that my immune system is starting to struggle and run a little bit low. I like to take this when I feel this coming on. So if you're interested, then just keep watching. I'm gonna make one for you so you can have one too. Why? So that you can try it with me. <laughs> The ingredients, more than likely you already have them at home. Six ingredient wellness shot for your immune system. What would you call this? A single serving blender, cold lemon, vitamin C. You didn't even notice I got my hair cut. Oh. Guess I didn't see that. Oh, and it looks very nice. They do such a good job. Yeah. Three inches, but I told her, I was like, the whole bottom layer, I want you to cut it off. I don't like to go in too heavy with ginger because then it makes me feel nauseous. So it kind of counteracts what I'm trying to do here. Grandma needs it, so I definitely can't use it all. I'm gonna go in with like a one inch little nub. Then turmeric, anti-inflammatory. This I got from Amatira, the place that I led the yoga retreat at. They grow the turmeric there, then they dry it, ground it up, and they put it in their own package, so it's super fresh. Is this a teaspoon or a tablespoon? The little ones. Teaspoon. With a teaspoon, a heaping teaspoon. Spilled just a little. Turmeric is absorbed by your body. Go in with some black pepper, a couple grounds of that. Otherwise, apparently the turmeric doesn't get absorbed. Honey, antibacterial and antiviral as well, as far as I know. A student gifted this to me. Homemade honey. Use that same teaspoon. Grandma's my live audience, right? Yes. So I don't need any pictures today for sure. But you'll try it with me? I'll try it with you, but not on TV. Okay. You should have warmed it up and it would have just poured out. Really? Like the whole jar? Sure. Pop it in the microwave? Okay, so with a nice somewhat overflowing teaspoon and then that'll take equally as long to pour in the yes single serve blender i did this right before i was going to costa rica because i thought i was getting sick and i woke up the next day and i felt just fine where did you get the recipe just in my head antibacterial and antiviral anti-inflammatory all of the above yeah and then the last ingredient is garlic. Oh boy. Antibacterial and antiviral, I think. For sure it's an antibacterial and it's good for fighting sickness. There's always garlic. There's always garlic. If Kevin was here, I would be making him take a shot with me, but if you're going to take this, I would highly encourage you to make the person that you live with or your significant other take the shot too, because you are going to smell like garlic. And you're going to go out tonight? And I'm going to go out tonight. Oh, that's not smart. They're going to say, see that cute little girl that she's skinny. Hi! Well, they're all just going to have to deal. I'm doing two garlic cloves. That way I can have one and then Graham gets one. Your mother's going to come over and tell them, I'm not going to go visit your grandma again. She's stinky. Stinky grandma. Grandma's going to be 87 next week on Christmas Eve. Yeah. This is what we have. I'm going to blend that up and then serve them up. I thought one of my hairs was in there. It's not. I'm going to add a little bit of water just so we can get more bang for our buck since I'm trying to split this between two and then blend it one more time. Do you have, so you can see me pour it up, you know? Yeah. Do you have the same girl cut your hair, Caitlin? No, I just walk in and say, I want a haircut. Well, I don't feel sick, so. I ha Well, I know. This, so do you want the smaller one? Of I was going to say I'll just level it out, but grandma, yeah. Grandma's saying she wants the smaller one, so. Looking out for Grandma. If there's one thing I'm here to do in this life. I'm not going to go there. No, I'm not going to go there. You can stand right here. You won't be in it. Come here. <laughs> I, I really, I don't want 
my picture. <laughs> Did I just get your arm? Cheers. 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 Oh, no. That turmeric. I know. She won't go on film though without any makeup on. However, I did get you for our Get Ready With Me video with no makeup on. I know you did one time. That was fun. It was. This is what I like to do if I'm struggling with my immune system and I feel as though I'm getting sick. So if you guys enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I upload videos every Thursday. Have a very Merry Christmas if you are celebrating. Happy Hanukkah, Happy Holidays, New Year, New Day, all those fun things. <gasps> I forgot. Be kind to yourself and be kind to others, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Now you gotta put everything away and try to get all of that cleaned up. This is a quick cleanup. That's nothing. Maybe that was your body getting healthier. Well, it should. I made the lentils today for lunch. Great. And I used, I made a sauce with red wine, vinegar, awesome. um, garlic, rose, rosemary, and I'll wait. Put that out. I that can. cabinet was open the whole time I filmed the outro. Shoot. That's um, okay. Things could have been worse. Yes, it could have been. My hair could still be scraggly, and it's not. It's very nice. Yeah, they did a great job. Capers, rosemary, wine vinegar, garlic clove, shallots. That sounds fabulous. And I put that over the lentils. Uh-huh. And it was very tasty. Sounds delish. Mess clean. Could you be getting chicken pox? Oh, are you sure? Positive.